Hey class, welcome back. This is week four of MIS 101 Computer Information Systems Management. Hopefully you guys had a wonderful week. Uh, this week we're going to go into chapter three, but before we get into that, I want to bring up a concern that I've had over the last few weeks. I want to let you guys know that I do see who actually watches these videos, these overview videos, and who doesn't, okay? I have the statistics for that. And I want to heavily emphasize that the importance of watching these videos to its entirety because this is the way I communicate with you guys. And I have sometimes I have a lot of important things that I need to communicate. Yes, most of the my course is pretty structured and will be on repeat, but there are times where I have to drop some information to you guys and you know you guys might miss it. Okay? So it's really important for everyone to watch this video to the or these overview videos to the entirety otherwise you know we would have to come back in class all right so it's really really important everyone to watch these videos um so far the statistics right now only a third of the class are actually watching you know the overview video all right and because of that um i'm gonna switch things up a little bit all right it's gonna be a little fun so who have Moving forward in your quizzes, I'm going to have a secret word, okay? Or a question with a secret word attached to it. Um, the secret word will be hidden in my video somewhere, uh, my overview video. And the only way you can get points for that specific question in your quiz is to answer the secret word, okay? Or put in the secret word. Uh, hopefully this will incentivize everyone to watch the videos, the overview videos, uh, and they pay attention. All right. Um, so in this week's quiz, if you see a question that says, what's the secret word of the week? The secret word of the week is going to be AirPods. All right. This is how you spell it. All right. A-I-R-P-O-D-S. And I'll leave a little comment section up there all right that is our secret word um so um when you take your quiz to, uh this week you might see a question that says what's the secret word it's gonna be airpods this week all right hopefully this will incentivize people to watch the video all right also one more thing i can tell how long each person actually spends on the video so if you're trying, just trying to like zoom in and out, trying to figure out where that secret word is moving forward, I can tell how long you've been watching the video. Just heads up. Anyways, heads up. Um, in two weeks, we'll be going into our uh, first midterm. And you'll see up here somewhere um, your exam time and date, exact date. Okay. So mark those in your books for your first midterm um, exam. Uh, and this is the first warning or first notification. Next week, I'll go over, um, I'll remind you guys again and kind of give you a sense of what to be reviewing. All right. It's nothing too big. It's mostly about understanding broad concepts and a lot of key terms. All right. So... Nothing too difficult. All right, with that, let's go ahead and jump in, log into Canvas and go into modules. So nothing really new, same structure as uh, the following week or prior weeks. We're just gonna go into chapter three, business intelligence systems, okay? So this first page is gonna be this video. All right, in chapter four, we're gonna mostly talk about artificial intelligence and how it affects information systems and you know how we can implement it and the potential, you know, um, um the the potential that it has right also you know business intelligence right um so go ahead read chapter three please read chapter three all right and then when you get a chance review the um review the powerpoint and once you review the just to make sure you kind of picked up on all the big concepts that you're supposed to get, you know? 
All right, so after you uh, skim through the PowerPoint, um, you're going to answer, you're going to do the discussion questions. All right, so discussion questions, it's going to relate back to what you've read in chapter three. All right, we're going to be looking at artificial intelligence and, you know, how it actually will, um, these two questions specifically, you know, so IBM has their own artificial intelligence uh, system called IBM Watson, right? And so the first question is, you know, how IBM Watson will be utilized for education. And then, um, you know, the second one is if AI powered robots, um, you know, could do human jobs, how will that negatively impact or positively impact, you know, our society? All right. so. Go ahead, read through these two questions, your discussion questions. Make sure you get a good understanding of how artificial intelligence as business intelligence will be implemented um, into businesses based off of, you know, the concepts I've learned. You know, you want to piece it together, right? Go ahead and answer the discussion questions and then respond to at least two other classmates by February 20th at 11.59 p.m. All right. Remember, you won't you won't get full credit unless you respond to all these two other people. Grammar, punctuation, capitalization. All right. It's all really, real important. Um, and so also, um, you know, it's college level course. And then next you'll have your uh, crossword puzzle. So go ahead, get that crossword puzzle and upload it here. And then finally you have your um, chapter three quiz. Five points, 20 minutes, one attempt. It shouldn't be too difficult. All right, so with that, uh, that's about it for this week. Um, just chapter three with you know your um, discussion questions and your quiz and your crossword puzzle. All right. With that, um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Remember, your first midterm is going to come up. And, you know, with that, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week. Let me know if you have any questions, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.